the Valka Pontica Chase 4 miles. Handicap chase, so 0 to 140. The top weight is Harley for the National. Joshua Sullivan got a lot of weight to carry out. Two is Blue Penny, Martin Needham. Three, Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. Four, the Bancher Man, Alex Cherry. That's come back for the third season, I think. Fourth is Woodland Venture, Dave Hoody. Irish Tony Craig Bethel and Tesla Storm. Graham Cloud about the seven horses in the Valka Paducah chase. And Teal Storm is quickly away for Graham Clatterbuck to lead them from Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. Then the Bancher Man coming back for another season. They jumped this and a slow jump by a, a mistake back here by Artisan Sundown has allowed this to for cause everyone to drop to the back of the field. So Teal Storm the leader from the Bancher Man. So they jumped the next and it's Teal Storm from the Bancher Man. Then comes Hardy for the National. Up the inside, Irish Tony for Craig Beckwith. Artisan Sundown recovered off to that blunder. Then uh, Hardy for the National. Blue Penny for Martin Needham. And Woodland Venture for Dave Hoody at the back of the field. They jump the water. They all go over it well. The crowd in the background, yeah. At Paducah, Teal Storm the leader from Irish Tony in second for Craig Beckwith. Then Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. Getting a lot of weight from Hardy for the National. He's stuck just behind that. They jump the next. A good jump by Artisan Sundown as they allowed him to come and join Teal Storm in the front. Then comes Irish Tony for Craig Beckwith with Hardy for the National just behind that. On the outside of that is Blue Penny. Two links back to the Bancher Man with Good Adventure at the back of the field to jump the next. All over it safely. Teal Storm, the leader from Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. Craig Beck was what's behind that. Irish Tony. Then the top weight, Hardy for the National. He apparently likes firm ground. On the outside, the Bancher Man, uh, Blue Penny. The Bancher Man just behind these. Normally runs a good race sometime in the season. And at the back of the field is Woodland Venture. It depends how much uh, ability remains for the Bancher Man. For Alex Cherry. Teal Storm, the leader from Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. has had a good start on the flat uh, this season. Irish Tony back in third. Then comes Blue Penny for Martin Needham. Joshua Sullivan's Hardy for the National just behind. The jump the next. Uh, good jump by Craig Beckwith's horse, uh, Irish Tony, who's gone up on the inside of Artisan Sundown. Dave Hoody's horse creeping closer. Woodland Venture at the back of the field is the Bancher Man for Alex Cherry. But there's only seven lengths. Uh, first to last here as uh, Graham Clutterback's horse in those red and Green colours and white colours, the are flag colours, takes them long, two jumps in quick succession and they all get over it slow, very, all get over it safely. Teal Storm the leader from Irish Tony in second, then comes Artisan Sundown, Hardy for the National, for uh, Graham, for Josh Estella, they jump the next. They all jump it well but slow at the back was Woodland Venture and has dropped to the back of the field again. Still a long way to go though, Teal's Fortune, the uh, Teal Storm the lead from Irish Tony in second. Uh, the White Steves and White Cap for Craig Beckworth. Just uh, on the outside of that, Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. Then comes Hardy for the National for Joshua Sutherland and those red and black stripes. Uh, Blue Penny. Two lengths back to Martin Leaves. Blue Penny won the Grand National last season. Uh, the Bancher Man just behind that. And then comes Woodland Venture for Dave Hooley, who is the current leader in the National Hunt Championship table. So Teal Storm. Graham Clutterbuck takes him along from Irish Tony in second. Not much change in the order yet. Artisan Sundown still in third. Hardy for the National still behind that. Two lengths back to Blue Penny. Then the Bancher Man and Woodland Nature. And they all jump that well. Still the leader, Teal Storm. No, no real big blunders by any of the horses so far. The Teal Storm when they come to the next. Jumps it slowly. Irish Tony a better jump back in second. Artisan Sundown going well in third for David Robertson. Hardy for the National is still travelling well back in fourth. Then comes the Bancher Man, who along with Woodland Venture seems to have really got a blue penny to the back of the field for Martin Eden's blue penny now the trailer. So Teal Storm. Two lengths clear of David Robertson's uh, Artisan Sundown is past Irish Tony now as they come to a fence jump. Uh, no bushes there. Teal Storm the leader from Hardy for the National in second. A pretty dangerous jump then actually with no bushes. Uh, Teal Storm the leader from Hardy for the National back in second. Uh, jump the next. And uh, not much difference, but not, not much uh, change in the order. A slow jump with Blue Penny at the back of the field. Another white fence jump here and a blunder at it by Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. The Teal Storm, the leader, forming second Hardy for the National. Then comes Irish Tony with Artisan Sundown on that one's inside. 
followed by Woodlands Venture. Teal Storm jumps the water well. It's four lengths clear of Hardy for the National in second. And moving closer on the outside, Woodland Venture is on the outside of Irish Tony, who's on turn on the outside of Oz and Sundown in those uh, light blue and turquoise stripes for. Uh, David Robertson with the yellow cap. Martin Needham's horse is the Blue Penny who's relegated the Bancher Man to the back of the field. They come to jump the next water jump and still Teal Storm. Travelling well in front leads them from in second Artisan Sundown and Hardy for the National. Blue Penny, uh, Irish Tony still there, then Woodland Venture. Blue Penny trying to keep closer and the Bancher Man is the trailer to jump the next. So Teal Storm the leader. As we go across the dirt. Coming to the two jumps in quick succession, Teal Storm over well, so is Artis and Venture over well, they're all over okay. The Mansion Man still trade up slightly slower those jumps with Woodland Venture though. So Teal Storm the leader from Artis and Sundown in second for David Robertson. Then comes Irish Tony and Hardy for the national for Joshua Sutherland in his red and black stuff. Here the most winners in the national hunt title last season. Hoping for a repeat. A small jump here as Teal Storm takes him along from in second Irish Tony. Then comes Artisan Sundown, uh, Hardy for the National just behind that, followed by Blue Penny. Woodland Venture trying to recover after some blunders, uh, and the back of the field, the Bancher Man. Teal Storm still jumping well in front. Two lengths clear of Irish Tony and Artisan Sundown, Hardy for the National, three lengths back to that. Then Blue Penny, last season's Grand National winning trainer, Martin Needham, and Dave Hoody, the trying to lead the championship at the moment with Woodland Venture behind that and the Bancher Man uh, returning horse for Alex Cherry at the back of the field. Uh, he's picked up some big wins in his career, the Bancher Man in the league. They jump the next and all go over well. The Bancher Man is still in touch at the back of the field but is now about uh, 10 lengths off the leader which is still Teal Storm for Graham Clover. They jump the neck and Teal Storm jumps it well. Irish Tony very slow in the air, gave it a lot of air. They come to the fences with no bushes again. Teal Storm the leader from Irish Tony in second. Then comes Artisan Sundown. Trying to move closer, Blue Penny. Woodland Venture is there. Hardy for the National has dropped back to sixth place and the Bancher Man struggling at the back of the field. Teal Storm the leader. Two lanes clear of Irish Tony. Woodland Venture is starting to get ahead of steam and has moved up into a share of second. Then Hardy for the National. Blue Penny and um, Artisan Sundown. But it's all changed now as Woodland Venture jumps to the front for Dave Hoody. It's Woodland Venture picks it up with five furs left to travel. Teal Storm is back in second. Then Irish Tony. Hardy for the National is trying to run on. They jump the next and they all jump it well enough. Although a uh, good jump for Irish Tony is taking up with him to a share of second. It's Woodland Venture from Teal Storm and Irish Tony. Wildly for the National in between horses. Artisan Venture on the outside trying to run and so is Blue Penny. But they got to get to Woodland Venture. It's stolen the march on this field. It's Woodland Venture for Dave Hooley. Six lengths clear of Artisan Sundown and Hardy for the National with three phones left to travel. They're not making much impression on the lead at this stage and it's Woodland Venture. Well clear. Six lengths clear of Artisan Sundown and Hardy for the National. I think the dangers may be in front because there's a lot of ground to make up. It's Ard Woodland Venture. From, for Dave Hoody has escaped this field by six lengths. A world hardly for the Nationals in second. Then Artisan Sundown and Irish Tony Blue Penny. Teal Storm's quite enough. It's Woodland Venture. As they come to the next jump, the final jump, and Woodland Venture over it well. And it's Woodland Venture hardly for the National trying to run on, but he's got a lot of weight to carry and given a lot of weight to Hot Woodland Venture. And Dave Hoody is going to pick up another winner on the last race of that week two. Woodland Venture for Dave Hoody. Yeah, we'll pick up the Paducah Chase. Woodland Venture wins it comfortably from Hardly for the National in second. Then came Artisan Sundown. Back in third. Right, and there someone decided to make a comment in the middle of the race. <laughs> uh, from the game, Woodland Venture, Dave Hooley wins the race. Second, Hardy for the National, a lot of weight. Uh, gave for uh, Joshua Sutherland, ran a really good race in considering that. Uh, third was uh, Artisan Sand and it didn't jump well. Then Blue Penny back in fourth for Martin Leedham and Irish Tony was back in fifth. And Teal Storm faded back into sixth place for Graham Clutterback.